Frenchtown resident Tremaine Brown is being hailed as a hero after his brave rescue of a 12-year-old child who was being swept away in a gully that runs through the inner city community. It all happened on Friday while Brown was working as a laborer at the Boys Town Community Center. The man just come out of Boys Town and see what I'm going and the youth just react. As soon as I seen him, my instinct was just to help him. Ronaldo Reynolds was playing with his friends in the gully when the water came gushing down. As we got down towards Maypen, there's a tree on the side and I've grabbed and hold my hand out to basically wait until they come, you see him? But the local boy started praying and when he started praying, it's like giving me strength. While Reynolds prayed, the people of the community were searching for him and his rescuer. So we don't know the gully from a tender age and so forth, so we stay and don't in a mere pen. Is it me? But the goal is long. Yeah, me up in the cemetery. But the goal is long. You understand? I don't know all the mark and all the tree, tree and them things, the vine, vine them and so forth. So we have to move past all of them things. We don't know them in the water. Them don't leave me. And we don't know them whereabouts. But we still up on the chill because we send that idea. We have to find them body more than say, yo, them gone. And we don't know. I'm trying to stand up in the water, but the way it just. Just blowing me. So as I'm trying to hold on, my foot scraped, my knee has scraped, everything. You see? Was there any time that you thought that knee was going to die? Yeah. Mm. There was a time when I thought we were both going to die. A couple more youth from jungle there, they thought we were sure the dog didn't say, okay, I need a gully. Because I need a gully, like it run from my rise side. You see? With that set gully, I meet up. So we are sure the man them see how we do the water run from the side. And with the water, you have to see how the man them go. I go, you go over there now and to roll up a man there now and you don't know man. Now nah, give up on the man and my call, call. Is even man man them get an answer. I never have fruit symbol I did. Where are you from? My mother is a fruit boy. Your mother? Yeah. Tell me about your mother. Why are you from your mother? Because she has a lot of pressure. Pressure fly up on people after you. Give me things to calm me. Pressure with pressure pill. So yesterday, you know, my father came from back to my sink. I never go down to the hospital. I never see nothing. I never see nothing. I don't know what could have inspired him for going to the gully. Whatever. Miss De Gunn says she always warned her son against playing in the gully. No, oh, we could have tell him that for going to the gully because I always tell him, say, did I do going to the gully there? Because four people wash when I eat already. Yeah. From that young little girl, four people and they never be found back. Mm -hmm. And now the Trenchtown mom says she feels indebted to Tremaine Brown for his heroic rescue and the community is grateful too. Me that said I'm on the next to God. Next to God. And I even, even if something wrong me that even take him like I'm my, my son. The way I love him now, I can't complete. I don't even know if he explain it. Brown, who is now 24 years old, migrated to the United Kingdom at age 6, but was deported to Jamaica six months ago. Damian Mitchell for The Gleaner Online.